Hello everyone, welcome to another video. Now before we start, I want to say a massive thank you. We've just hit 45,000 subscribers. It absolutely blows my mind that that number there keeps on rising. So thank you very much indeed to every single one of you. I really, really do appreciate it. If you do like this kind of thing and you haven't yet subscribed, please consider clicking on that subscribe button. And at any point during this video, if you do like what you see, please remember to click on the like button. So, on with the video. We're here at Imola for a Skip Barber race. It's 11 laps. I tried this race earlier on, on my main account, failed miserably. Somebody took me out and I lost a ton of I rating. So, I quickly changed accounts and we're on the Mac Evad account. I thought, well, people have been asking for a GoPro video in an open wheeler for God knows how long. So here it is. So it's a point of view video, 11 laps around Imola in the Skip Barber. We don't have any UI, so all we've got is our eyes, the mirrors, and our spotter. So we've got no UI, and for this one, you don't either. So, as you know, in the Skip Barber series, anything can happen at any given time. So, enough waffling, let's get on track. Good luck, Rakes. The air temp is 29 Celsius. Good luck. Okay, Mac, get ready. Right, here we go. Go, go, go. Get the feeling this might not have been a good idea. Try and skip past him. You can. On your right. Go by him. Good, good, Still good. Still there. Gotta watch for cold tyres. Still there. He's still there. Clear right. Car left. Clear left. Car right. Still there. Right side's clear. Good this work is on sketchy, the start, this mate. bit. This is great. Right side. Clear right. There's one off, is it? No. Just a bit of smoke. Car right. I'll Clear take a one right. X. I'll take a one left X. Side. Crikey. Clear left. Bit of work to do now though. Gap behind now. So I've no idea where we are. You guys don't either. Turned off the relative on purpose. There's an incident in. Rabatso one. Yeah, no, like I'm not really now. The upload that was really stupid. <laughs> right, can we catch up? Bit of a gap. Bit of a gap behind though. No pressure. Well Just done, try and this is great. stay on track. Keep nailing those exits. Yeah, I'm going to on the bottom one. Six. Well, that wasn't good. Try and be smooth, okay? Get off there. These guys start battling. And we could be could be in with a shot at the top five. Get off there. Uh, 
You know, we need these guys to start fighting quickly. I think we're a little bit closer. I think we are a little bit. If these guys in front are smart, then they won't battle with the. We are just done a 205.71. What do we do? 2057 from the leader. No idea. You're going to tell me. we we'll break a bit later for turn one, I'm sure. Definitely closer. Definitely closer. Can we catch up? And if we do, can we get past? Front. The gap's now 3.1 seconds. 3.1, blimey. That's a gap. Uh. Ooh. Yellow cars checking out now. So that blue car is the top five, though. Fastest lap for McLeod, 205.17. That last lap was a 206.24. That's your Blimey. quickest lap in this session. Miles off the pace. It's a gap now, about two seconds. We're not gaining very quickly. Sixth place. So we need him to make another mistake down here. This is what he did last lap. He locked the wheels up. <laughs> he did it again. We were kind of focused on him. Now we're in draft. I think it looked like he put two wheels on the grass there. The leader's just done a 204.62. It's 
So this is the top five. On your right. Hold your line. He's still there. Right side's clear. Come on, Mac. Good stuff. Keep it coming. Don't think we can get this guy, though. Unless he makes a mistake. But we need to be going a lot quicker than what we're going. I can probably throw it in there a bit quicker as well. The car behind is reeling you in. The gap is now 0 Yeah, that gap's probably about three and a half seconds, four seconds, I would guess. A bit too far, unless he makes some mistakes. Did he get round? He did, he got round that time. The leader has just done a 204.63. That was going to send it. It's right on my tail. Okay, Mac, hold your nerve, just keep it smooth, no mistakes. Trying, Jim. Pulled a little gap on that guy behind now. Here's a bit further back this time. This guy's a bit further up the road, I think, as well. So we're just kind of waiting for uh, something up front to happen. Okay, Mac. Halfway home. Fuel's good. That's your quickest lap. Just need to be a bit more aggressive, I think. Those three up front are battling, though. Something can happen with those guys.
it looks it's okay. time to get closer. The gap is 3.2 seconds. I thought it looked closer. Now, 0.9. Just don't want to overdo it, though. Places like that, it's so easy just to overcook it a little bit. So it was 3.2, see if it tells us what it is now. You've just done a 205.19, that's your best lap in this session. Sector 1 is 0 0.46, off the pace. Yeah, it felt faster that one. I don't know where I was much quicker though. Is it maybe here at the top of the hill? I seem to throw it in a bit quicker there previously. Definitely closer. Hopefully he's watching his relative and paying attention to that instead of paying attention to where he needs to be. Sloppy. Come on, Mac. Push, push, push. We can get this guy. New fastest lap for McLeod. 204, Mac 35. Sector 1 is 0 0.49 off the pace. You're a tenth off the pace in Sector 2. You're two tenths off the pace in Sector 3. We're not really making any ground though. Hmm, we seem to have now though. The gap in front is through that section. Yeah, it's come down about a second. Be slow down. I'll take a one X, but I don't want to slow down. That would ruin the charge. Yeah, 
He's lit the tyres up here a couple of times on the trot. A couple more laps at this pace, then we could have him, or we could catch up anyway. Enough to be in draft. Times are improving. A little bit greedy into there. So he is where he was slower last time through here. Definitely reeling him in. Come on. It's taken me a while to warm up. Don't know how many more laps are remaining though. Maybe two, three. One, Jim, tell us the gap. Yeah, it's over two seconds. The gap ahead is now 2.2. .2. Two laps left. That lap was at 205.07. Sector one is 0 0.6 off the pace. Need a good run. Need a good run through here now. Gotta be brave. Brave, not stupid. Gonna have to make a mistake. The leader has just done a two oh three point eight four. On your left, clear left. One more to go.
Damn, another lap, another two laps. Front is now 1.4 seconds. Yeah, just about in draft. A little bit too late though, a little bit too late. She's on him now though. Oh, it's a slow down. <laughs> Keep the pressure on now though. Has binned it in. Rivazza one. We need to slow down to give back the time gained. Yeah, classic you. Incident in. Rivazza two. We think it might be McLeod. Get rid of this slow down. Yeah, you're clearly sorry when you don't wait up. You dickhead. <laughs> yeah, Michael. Mitchell, or whatever. That was awesome. Well done, Matt. Great That's drive. Nice That's a report. <laughs> Congrats. Podium. For the salt as well. Thank you. Pay homage to the great man. Get all them up there. Yay! We've got a podium. What a place that must be to watch. Uh, one up on, uh, Victoria, Pablo. Who lives there? Thank you. Thank you. Thanks for coming, everybody. Thanks for coming. Well, a good push towards the end there, though. Well, we're catching that guy. Another lap, I think we might have had him. But a lot of driving around on my own, just hot lapping, getting used to the car. But I think uh, by the end of it, I think we were, uh, weren't too far off pace, I think. Around about 205 flat without draft. I'll take that. What are these buildings? Let's park up. Oh, I don't want enough track. Let's park up and have a look at the incidents. Right, let's have a look at the carnage and see what Mitchell was unhappy about. Oh, this is the guy right in front of us, we had to take evasive. Not lucky there. No, oh, that guy didn't. Oh! Has he touched? No. Well done. Same guy, is it? Same guy? Ah, just jumping. It's got to be a bit of that. See ya. jumps. There's going to be a few of those. Skip them if they're going to be on there. It's got potential. The love tap. Oh. <laughs> Where's that guy going on? No. Oh. Just jumps here. Yeah, that's that's uh, an interesting line. Oh, 
Oh, styled it. Just jumps. Come on, let's get to the good stuff. Okay, so it was on the second to last corner, wasn't it? No time for blinkers. Oh, my me. What's it going to do here? Go on, you can do it, you can do it, you can do it. Are these are these cars just mating? Got to, we've got to see the end product here, haven't we? Oh no. Blinked. Oh, we're still going. No, one's gone. Up to him. Blinked. Ah, this is it. So that's Mitchell in front. Last lap. Ah, yeah. I'd be a little bit uh, annoyed as well, I think. Is his car wrecked? Because Mitchell finished a lap down. Oh. That looked a bit naughty. Mitchell, you naughty boy. Have a look again. So the guy that ran into the back of Mitchell's behind him now. Then goes to the overtake. Mm. Naughty boy. And that's it done, I think. It is. Right, let's have a look at the results. So, there were three splits. This was top split strength of field, 2,194. So, we gained 0 0.01 safety rating, but 51 I rating. Happy days. So, Craig got the win. Thomas, who we were hunting down for a few laps, finished P2, and we managed to... Sneak in to P3, fastest lap of 204.8 on lap 11. That's without draft, so I'm happy with that. Three incident points. So who was the biggest winner? Well, it looks like it's Thomas who finished in P2. He gained 87. And the biggest loser is Mitchell, Mitchell McLeod. He lost 83. So there we go. I rate again, safety rate again. Somehow... Managed to sneak on the podium. We were pushing for about five or six laps there, catching that guy. I think another lap, two laps, we might have had him. Got lucky at the end with a couple of positions that those guys that span off. But as I mentioned at the beginning, it's a Skip Barber series. Anything can happen at any given time. So if you did like this video, please remember, click on that like button. And if you want to see more, you can click on this icon down here. Straight over here will be my latest video on a video that YouTube thinks that you might like to watch. As always, thanks for watching. See you later. Cheers.